Welcome, everybody. Thanks for joining us for NBA Action on 2K Sports. This is Kevin Harlan with Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony. David Aldridge is on our sideline. Here's the starting group for Houston. They've got Tracy McGrady. Jawan Howard is out there with Yao. And it's ABC. And it's Alston in at the one spot. And for the Kings, Martin is out there with Mike Bibby. Then it's Miller. Then there's our test. And it's Abdul Rahim in at the power forward position. Well, we know the players enjoy the rest they get during All-Star Weekend. But, Greg, do you think it should be moved to later in the season? I like how the current format splits up the season, but it, it seems more fair to hold an All-Star towards the end of the season so that voters get a more complete look at each player. Tip-off goes to Houston. Alston against Bibby. Alston passes to Yao, and it's tonight. to our test and contact on the shot so he'll be shooting free throws here first personal foul you're, you're not going to find a foul. more rush shooting two That's good from our test. Both good from the line that time. The pass to Yao. And finished off by Yao. Check out Yao doing big man things. I mean, this guy's size makes those openings easy picking. Now, here is Mark. Yao with the block. And so it looks like the Kings will retain possession here. A sensational block that definitely deserves another look. A defensive play like that early in the game can go a long way. Establishes an attitude that you want to have during the game. Outside our test. Over Bowen. Our test. Good. And the lack of effort to fight over the screen there makes that an easy shot. Well, I'm going to credit the screen. I mean, that's a good, strong pick he lays there. To the inside. That's good from Bibby on the assist from Kevin Martin. And once he got to the 10 to find himself that wide open. Well, this early, they should be showing a lot more energy on defense. It's not there. Now, here is McGrady. He carries a very heavy load for him offensively, averaging nearly 32 points a game. Here's our test. Makes it off the glass. Our test has got six points. Boy, he is looking confident. Love how they're using him so far and you know you know you're gonna have success when you can start out shooting 80 percent from the game so early offensively they've been great that's the way you like to start alston against bibby alston passes to yao the yeah, shot's man. good alston making the play and this is way too easy for me using his massive size to do a lot of damage inside outside mark Here in the first, just under two and a half minutes played so far. For Houston, they've gone two of five here, making 40% so far to start out the game. And Yao, Yao slams man. it in. Really nice job moving the ball around that time, picking apart that defense. A round of applause, your Sacramento dancers. Here's McGrady. Trains it from 17 feet out. McGrady, as accomplished a mid-range shooter as we have in the game, keeps that high release point on the jump shot. Outside, Martin. Back to Bibby. Martin against McGrady. 
Puts one up from 19. Here's Miller, and it's Miller with the jam. There it is. Dunks it down. Yeah, and you got to respect the size McGrady has. Easily seen over the defense there to spot the open man. Outside our test. Here's Miller. That shot, no good. And Houston the other way now. Here's McGrady. That falls. Great assist by Rafer Alston. Alston's got his third assist on the night. Timeout called by the Kings. As the teams head into this timeout, a chance for the coaches now to map out some plays for the next few minutes and a chance for the players to rehydrate with here early. I mean, they struck first on the offensive glass. And those put-back baskets contributing Tracy to their lead. lead. That That's one fun. drops for them. And they're forcing the ball inside, and it's working like a charm. Bibby kicks to well. King's moving the ball around. And Garcia has it in the corner. That's good. It's Pibby with the assist that time. I like their focus coming in. Terrific execution so far. And you know, it's an all-out effort they've come in with. Very aggressive offense so far. Now, here is McGrady. He's got six. Yep, that one goes. Matumbo's got six. Yep, it counts. What muscle from McGrady right there. Brushing off the defense with ease. Now, here is Bibby from deep three-point range, and the last shot of the buzzer doesn't That's go in for him. No Good shortage score. of scoring here at the end of the first quarter. In Sacramento, up by four. And we'll be back in just a moment with the start of the second quarter. And the grit Artes showing here as he finishes through some pretty physical contact. But this guy too strong to let that kind of physical play bother him. Outside, Martin. Pass to Garcia. Inside, right block shot. Trying to get open is Miller. And Artes with the basket on the assist from Garcia. Garcia's got his fourth assist with that last one here tonight. Head kicks to West. Pass to Bogans. Some nice passing there by Houston. And with that shot, the Sacramento lead is cut to just seven. Our test's got 12 points in the game. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now, especially on the interior. Yeah, and that's four straight field goals now they've allowed from point blank range. Can't happen. Here's Yao after Ron Artest's bucket and the pass to West. Here's Bowen, covered by Williamson. Yao kicks to Bogans. From deep, out that one, and the Kings lead has been cut down to six on the bucket from Wesley. David Wesley has a nice looking release on that three point shot, so you got to respect him from there. Now a timeout called by Sacramento. to Wells. Back to our test. Gets it to go for bucket number eight. He's taken just ten shots. And he has his fingerprints all over this first half. He is just shooting it so efficiently. Here's McGrady to the paint. Yao kicks to West. Yao trying to break free. They get it again. And finished off by Yao. And Ming is, is mammoth in terms of his size. Exceptional at using it to snare those offensive rebounds. And now the quarter. And McGrady has an impressive vertical there, showing once again with how well he dumps the basketball. Sacramento leading by seven. Bibby kicks to Wells. Bibby passes to Wells. Some nice ball movement here by the Kings. Here's Abdul Rahim. The Rockets pull it in. Matumbo's got his fourth rebound in this one. 
eight second difference between the shot clock and the game clock. Out to the right wing. On the wing, Tracy McGrady, covered by Williamson. And they'll keep possession. And the basket by Matsubo. And it's the Rockets with the ball. Here's Head. And that one released in time, but no good. And some good action through the first two quarters as we reach halftime. King lead by five. And we'll be back for the second half following the break. Keep it right here on 2K Sports. And now, the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hello again, folks. Ernie Johnson here with Kenny the Jet Smith and Shaquille O'Neal. It's the NBA on 2K Sports, and let's talk the first half. Kings, Kenny, what's your viewpoint? Well, first and foremost, you got to take care of the basketball, and that means playing with poise, making good decisions, and not giving away any possession. They did a great job of that in the first half. Shaq, let's get your insight on the visiting team. I like their commitment to getting to the line. Their aggressive approach is frustrating the defense. I like that. The drawing fouls at a very high rate. I like that. Wouldn't be surprised if someone gets ejected. I will like that too. That's all for now. Say goodbye to the folks. Thanks goodbye, for folks. joining us. Third quarter, just about ready to begin. That's all for now. Say goodbye to the folks. Thanks Goodbye, for folks. joining us. Third quarter, just about ready to begin. Get loud and make some noise. Very and as we get into this third quarter, as we've seen so far, neither team able to create much separation on the scoreboard yet. On our test has been sensational. Man, he's been running wild on them through that first half. Absolute dynamite on offense. And you know what? I'll be interested to see just how much he's got left in the tank. That first half had to take a lot out of him. Last, but couldn't knock it down. McGrady against Bibby. McGrady passes to Swift. And the powerful one-handed slam. Oh, just solid on the one-handed slam. And guys, when it's a tight ball game like this, he's the guy they want with the ball. Somebody you can count on. He is an extremely reliable finisher. Passes to Martin. Now, here is Bibby. Driving inside. And denied. He sends it right off the glass. It is good. Abdul Rahim's got his first basket of the night. It is so solid at setting the pace. Excellent when it comes to finding. To slow the game down. Try to get some easy ones. The pass to Alston. Come get it. Come get it. Six on the shot clock. The second chance effort. It counts. And the foul. Mike Bibby. It's on Mike Bibby. Everything going to plan here to start the third. 80% shooting thus far. Pretty much automatic tonight at the line, tonight at the line eight for eight. Tracy McGrady, one shot. That one drops, he ties to Williamson. Here's Wells, got a piece of it. Excellent job by McGrady using his length to deny that shot. For Houston, they've gone eight of 16 in the third quarter to put their second half shooting percentage right at 50%. From the arc, a three-pointer is right on target. McGrady's got 26 points. It, it took a long time for him to get that first triple. Let, let's see now, though, if he can get going. Garcia against Yao. Passes it to Thomas. Uses the glass to finish the way. Yes. Thomas got 10 points. Three quarters of play in a close game here. Houston on top, top one. And time for the short break and stay right where you are. The fourth quarter is coming up next.
And now let's go back to a play from earlier as we show you our State Farm assist of the game. It's just true artistry right there. I mean, great decision on where to go with the ball. And how about the perfect delivery? And they'd love Three tenths quarters behind us. One more to go. Thanks for being with us as we begin the fourth. So on the four for Houston. Jawan Howard is out there with Bogans. Then there's Head. Then there's Rafer Alston. And it's Matumbo. And at the pivot, Keep handing the middle. And those are the types of shots down the stretch that win you ball game. Williams in left side. Great D that time from Howard. I'm a fan of anybody who defends that way. I mean, they weren't about to open Keep the door moving. and just allow him to cruise in for a layup. You got to love his hustle, leaving the defense no time to react. And you know you're going to get those balls. Sacramento again missing. Misfires again, and the ball just refuses to cooperate with him. It's a tough day so far. And it's slammed in by Howard. Assisted. And they've done some nice work as we've come down the stretch here in the final quarter. You can feel the sense of urgency they have to get this thing closed out as soon as possible. Now here is Miller. Passes it to Wells. Got a piece of it. He dishes it to Bibby to end the run. Rebounded by Dikembe Matumbo. Matumbo's got nine rebounds in the game. Heading over. Tracy McGrady's checked in for Luther Head. And it's Wesley in for Rafer Alston. And this has been a great job of just getting into the middle of that defense and really scoring effectively from the paint. Now here is McGrady. And Yao slams it in. Oh, going high to throw that one down. Sky high. Fantastic one-hand jam. Boy, a nice way to punctuate that possession. Here's our test. Back to Bibby. Beyond the arc. Rebound by Yao Ming. Yao's got rebound number 11 for him here tonight. Oof, rough game offensively. He's really struggled. It, it really, they're trailing. And Yao just so big, he's able to see over the top of the defense. And that allows him to find an open teammate. Inside. And here comes McGrady leading the fast break. Gets the bucket and the foul. And so he's picked up his final foul. And he will sit for the rest of this game. Yeah, and, and luckily they've got terrific depth at that position. If there's one spot on the floor where they can afford to lose somebody, that would probably be it. Keith Bogan, he's checked in for ABC. Free throw good, McGrady ball. And some nice passing there by Houston. Here's McGrady. Hits the three-point bomb. McGrady's got the lead up to 11 now for Houston. He's certainly been their go-to guy when it matters most. He's trying to close this one out. Goes up with a stripe. And it's our test missing. And so here is Houston. And he gets the whistle. Two free throws coming up. That one is on our test. Second team foul. Shooting for Houston. Tracy McGrady at the line. Shooting two. And he knocks down the first one. Houston making some changes. ABC comes in for Jawan Howard. And Luther Head subbed in for Keith Bogans. And McGrady drops them both. And now we present our New Balance Player of the Game, Yao Ming. We saw outstanding focus and really good energy from him all the minutes he was on the floor. He was determined to make an impact every time he touched the ball, and he did just that. Guys on both squads could learn a lot from what he did here tonight. 
This was a big game for him. There's no denying that. Coming off a bunch of losses in a row. They turned to him to break the streak, and he delivered in a big... Jacks up a three. They grabbed their own miss. Here's Garbage Man. So we see Houston taking the W here. This was a very strong showing for him, Greg. Not necessarily a runaway win, but one they'll feel very good about. And let's face it, anytime you can go on the road and win in the fashion they did, you have to feel good about it. Really an outstanding effort all the way around. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. For David Aldridge, Greg Anthony, and Clark Kellogg, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for being with us. We'll see you next time. Have a great evening. Thank <laughs> you.